Pumping gas, obviously it's a common thing, but can some of your actions make it a dangerous thing? A viewer asked us to verify if static electricity or leaving your car engine on while pumping gas can actually start a fire. We went to Macon Bibb Fire Prevention Director Chief Brenda Thomas for answers. Chelsea Bimeford joins us live to tell us what she found out. Yeah, Frank, we're out filling up a station car right now just down the street on Gray Highway. As you can see, the engine to our car is off, and today we learned there's a pretty good reason for that. When you pull into a gas station, there's usually a sign on the pump you can't miss. Turn off your engine, no smoking, discharge your static electricity. But what happens if you ignore the warning? You have to pay attention to the signage. Signage is very important. And the reason that they are there because there have been problems. Macon Bibb Fire Prevention Director Chief Brenda Thomas says when gas vapors mix with heat and electricity, flames could erupt. All that's dangerous with their engine running and the static electricity, those are very dangerous things that can cause fires, uh, potential for a fire. Thomas says it's rare, but it's real. Although you have, may not see it around in your neighborhoods or where you live, it actually is a fact that those things can cause a fire. Thomas says when you slide out of your car, you create friction or static electricity that can be transferred from your body to the pump. I always run your hand back across that metal, the side door of your car, so you can try to disturb that static electricity. The Petroleum Equipment Institute reports that static related fires at the pump appear to be more prevalent during the winter months when it's cold outside. Thomas says that's also when people are more likely to leave their engines running, but that could spark a fire if the heat from the engine comes in contact with fuel. But it's very true, it's not a myth, it is fact. So yes, we verify that static electricity and leaving your car engine on can create the conditions to start a fire. It's very rare, but it's very real. <laughs> so just remember that rare, but very real and very dangerous. So just make sure you're paying attention to the signs up here. And as Thomas just said, it is rare that a fire would start, but it is real. It's a possibility and it's very dangerous. In Macon, Chelsea Byam for 13 WMAZ Eyewitness News. Frank, back to you in the studio. All right, Chelsea, very good advice. Thank you.